Good morning, everyone. So I've started the day off outside piddling with the greenhouse some. And I had get a little of my oil spray. I've had just a, a few signs of bugs. We have sand gnats. And they get in the soil, and whenever it gets nice and warm in here, they do hatch out, and I get sand gnats. And so anyway, I spray as much for them as anything else. And I pick peppers. I'm really pleased with that, as I jokingly tell people, you know, a few peppers here and there during the winter, and it helps cover the cost of the greenhouse, because... They get kind of expensive around here in the winter time if you have to buy them from a store. So anyway, the papayas, since I moved them in, I'm getting some more growth on, on them, the stumps and all. Um, getting flowers on my... Um, alligator plant it's in the family of aloe and i can't remember the other name the scientific name and all that kind of stuff but anyway they're growing out real well and i use it uh, these are the other papaya stumps and they're still sprouting and my kratom back here is looking good i broke some leaves off when i was picking the peppers the peppers are behind this kratom and so, clumsy me, I break things all the time. Uh, I came back on the, I did the video of getting the ginger. I ended up taking seven pounds and a little extra out of this. And there's still a really nice root here in the pot, which I'll cover it up and let it go for next year, most likely. And I did a video a while ago on my Kratom tea, and that's what I'm I'm out here now sipping on a cup of Kratom tea. And hopefully I'll, it'll help me make it on through the day and get a little bit more done. I haven't been feeling well lately. And these are the cuttings that I had taken back... Um, November the 6th is whenever I took them. And some of them are, are still looking green and look like they've got some new growth to them. And some others just look like they're probably going to die or dead, <laughs> whatever the case may be. But anyway, I've uncovered them. And uh, I was thinking that I'll probably do the after the oil sprays that I did on everything. I'll probably come back a little later today and do a uh, spray and grow on them. Some things can use a shot of fertilizer this time of year and others really don't need it. And I need to get in here and pick my mulberries. And my jackfruit hadn't slowed down there a bit as far as growing. These three here are really looking good. And my avocado back there is really doing well. And uh, the pink hibiscus that I'd gotten from my ex back there has got more blooms starting to open on it. Really proud of that. Need some more water on the lemongrass. The moringa up here where it's been touching and freezing doesn't look real well, but the stalk itself isn't hurt and it's still growing. Lots of new growth on a lot of things. All in all, for this time of year and 
me not being out here working at it every day or some days here lately it's been two or three days between even opening up the the greenhouse i'm very pleased with the way everything is looking that was a kratom leaf that i had break broke off picking the peppers the miracle fruit there is really looking good and the little ones down under the counter there have, since they've gotten in the shade i like to burn them up whenever i first moved them in here and had them setting up on the top of the shelf but they're coming back now blessings all